Good evening to you and a warm welcome to the part of West London where the Kings Road and Fulham Road meet, Stamford Bridge. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray at the microphone and sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player Stuart Robson. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It's Chelsea against Borussia Dortmund. Well, the first game of the group is so vital. You just can't get off to a losing start. This could be a tight battle today, Derek. For Chelsea, Edouard Mendy starts in goal. Thiago Silva plays alongside Kalidou Koulibaly in central defence. Hakim Ziyech plays with Raheem Sterling out wide. And the striker today is Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Number 16, Edouard Mendy. Number 24, Rhys James. Number 6, Bellingham starts alongside Marco Reus in central midfield and the striker of choice is the powerful and lethal Sebastian Allaire. It's the opening match day, Champions League group stage, match day one, underway. He's protecting it effectively. And fired against the crossbar. Well, nothing untoward happened. And Chelsea get the decision from the referee. Well, it's been a good start by Dortmund. I'm not quite sure how they're not leading here. Yes, a really open flow to the game. End-to-end -end stuff. Well, offside, Stuart, when that pass was made. Well, he should have let that run. He was always going to be offside. Well, sloppy in possession. Good work to win it back high up the pitch. Brandt. And winning it back. Great block from Thiago Silva. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Ziyech. Now Conte. And return to Aubameyang. Firing it towards goal. Nicely saved. Well, here we can see it again. Incredibly close, but the correct decision. No goal. <laughs> Playing it in. No keeper will mind that sort of corner. And with that, the attack fizzles out. 
Emre Can. Royce. Rule to have taken up an illegal position only just. Couldn't keep it. Joao Felix. Ziesch. And return to Joao Felix. James. Now Conte. Kovacic. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. Now sending it in. Well, it has come to nothing. Kovacic. On to Chilwell. What an important piece of defending. A oh, very effective play, and they might be onto something. Gets in the way once more. Well, the counter chance looks very real. And teammates to play it to. Grant. And the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty given. Well, some might say he's been fortunate to avoid being shown the card. Well, I like that from the referee. Just because it's a penalty doesn't mean it's a yellow card. I think he's got it right. This to open the scoring here. Well, let's look at this again. And the keeper just lost his bearings there. He was never in the right position. He won't want to see that again. So Chelsea get things going again. How will they reply to that setback? Mateo Kovacic. It's with Koulibaly. Oh, couldn't quite find his teammate. Aubameyang. Well, Dortmund just can't dominate the possession, but that won't bother them because when they win it in deep areas, they've got forward with pace and with numbers. It's been a great counter-attacking display. Yes, a really effective performance all in all. Decided to come in from the flank and block for now. And he's fired over the corner. And a struggle to get it away properly. And well, they've won the ball back quickly. And a shame that he couldn't find the target from there. Mateo Kovacic on the ball Joao Felix Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang free kick to Chelsea possession one and room now out on the wing chance here Nicely cut out. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. And the first 45 minutes have come and gone here at Stamford Bridge.
I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the play. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Felix, he read the situation defensively and did his job. And over the touchline for what will be a Dortmund throw. Nico Schlotterbeck. And just missed that little bit of attacking spark. Goalkeeper's ball. And Bellingham. Can he put it away? And diving to thwart him. Here it is now. A substitution. Trying to deliver it accurately. And the problem not completely solved. And still danger here. Corner to Borussia Dortmund. What can they do with this one? And clears his lines. Danger averted for now, but it'll be another corner. Guerrero with the corner. doing his job clearing it off the line and there it is a goal I must say much to the annoyance of the keeper well here we can see it again normally I'm the first to point the finger at a goalkeeper but I think it's a good initial save I'm not sure he could have done much more just a bit unfortunate really that it dropped to an opponent They will now make use of the substitutes bench. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Concession worker, please go to the ticket office. Sterling. Thank you. And Obama Young now. Sterling. Now with Chilwell. And he read it well defensively. Emre Can. On to Allaire. Guerrero. And an astute piece of defending. Great ball from Raheem Sterling. It was a menacing attack, but tidied up. Sterling there to take it away chances on and effectively parried away by the keeper and Zula acquitted himself superbly to win it back Guerrero On to Allaire. Oh, he saved it well. Substitution it is for Dortmund. And delivered by Rafael Guerrero. Well, it was a crowded penalty area, but the keeper's done well to hold on to that. Oh, big chance. Majestic piece of goalkeeping. Well, he loves the big moments, doesn't he? And he's proved it again there. Great goalkeeping. Well, this has to be their way back into the game. The crowd are certainly playing their part. Not away completely. Mount. 
Now Conte. Conte has it. Sterling. On to Mount. Can he finish? And the keeper more than equal to the task. And Dortmund will go to the bench. And over comes the corner. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Ziyech. And now Sterling. And that was simply miles off target. Well, I think he's right to go for power, but he's made the wrong connection, and it's really poor technique in the end. Brandt. Chance to do damage. But the danger averted for now. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Aubameyang! It was an excellent example of how to break at pace. Well, that's counter-attacking football at its best. They switch on so quickly when they win the ball back. It deserved a goal. And Bellingham, surely, just can't get it past him. And teammates around him. Ziyech. And possibilities here. Aubameyang! They've got themselves back into it. A lifeline in this game. And this could be a dramatic finale. Well, as the replay shows us, Ziyech's pass is inch-perfect, and Aubameyang finds that bit of space to finish so clinically. That's an excellent goal. Well, underway again. It's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand. <laughs> Bellingham. Perfect tackle. Throw in here for Borussia Dortmund. Sebastian Aller. Dortmund have been awarded the free kick by the referee. Well, the execution there rather went awry. Well, Derek, the less said about that, the better, I think. Went in strongly to win the ball. Free kick to Chelsea. Well, the electronic board showing three additional minutes. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Wonderfully weighted pass. It is going to be a Dortmund free kick. And he whips it in. And the danger's still on. The end of this particular story, and for whatever reason, it didn't go as a plan for Chelsea. It's a poor start to their Champions League season. Yeah, they'll be disappointed. It's an uphill battle if you don't get anything from your opening game. It really comes down to how they bounce back now. Vital we see a better performance next time out. Well, I don't think, Stuart, anyone can really quibble about what he put into the game. Well, he was a major reason why they won today. He was so reliable, and he inspires those around him. Dead.